boring. Hey, hey, Grant! Why are you dead, you noob? I'm the blob monster, and I have reborn, and I am gonna rule the city and the earth, of course. But I want to do that, but bad guys always turn out to be bad, so bye. <laughs> travels in my life. This is me, Mr. Doy's Classroom Circa 2008. I was a very naughty boy. I went out to, to lunch and I peed on a wall. Mr. Doy found me and brought me home. I would be, I would cry in my German lessons because I don't know how to speak German very well. And yeah. So I was born and lived in Brazil until I was six. We have this food called feijoada, which is rice, beans, and meat with oranges and flour, it's very good, it's very tasty. And down here's the Rio de Janeiro with Christ on the hill, has 200 million people. The United States has 200 million, 300 million people. Uh, Costa Rica has 6 million people. It's a very small country in Central America, full of jungle and beaches. Brazil is full of rich foods and a lot of racial and uh, money disquality. So lots of poor people, lots of rich people fighting. So in Germany, I ate a lot of a lot of a lot of pretzels and sausages. And Germany is very pretty, very old, wet, like a building is really cool. Then I came back to Brazil, and then we have these pastries called sfijas, which is basically a Syrian dish of meat or cheese on some bread. Very tasty. And Sao Paulo, the city I live in, is full of skyscrapers. Then I moved to Costa Rica, which is in Central America. And they also eat rice and beans with eggs. And there's lots of beaches there. And then Mr. Kenneth, you know, he knows his cheeseburgers well because he's from the States. They have very good cheeseburgers. And I went and lived in Boston for a while to study psychology. Then back to Brazil, there was a jealous Japanese movement in Brazil. And they have these foods called temaki, which is uh, fish rolled up with rice in that little cone. And Brazil has lots of cool, pretty flat beaches, as you can see down there. The last picture is a favela. It's a slum where lots of poor people live. Uh, there's lots of violence in these places because there's lots of disparities between the rich and the poor. And I like focus, faith, and force because I'm a Star Wars fan. Uh, and the Buddha, of course, you got to meditate brief. When you got too much homework, Thomas, you kind of you need to make a stop motion of all of you or you know, go draw something, do something fun, play video games. I'm a big video game guy. So my fun hobbies, I had a teddy bear since I was like, since I was born. I called him Teddy, because he's my teddy bear. Here's some of my Lego sets and some posters. That, I don't know, and here's my dog, Yoda. He's very cute and kind. And I play the guitar. I'm starting to at least. And I also became a ski athlete here on the corner. Skiing on wheels, on roads. It's very... Cool. It has a nice rhythm moving your body. Uh, I like playing Lego, so you can see my stop motions. Hopefully you enjoy them. Mr. O taught me patience and uh, how to be a good kid. And I'm now trying to finish college or university, which is hard. And I heard you're all in Korea. I don't know if I've been in Korean, but I watched the Mark Flyer, so maybe, you know, he's Korean. And I don't know how Mr. Doi teaches you, treats all of you because he's a very evil person. Stay away from him. No, I'm joking. I... I love traveling, even though you get tired. But I like to eat a lot of candy and chocolate. You know, I'm a kind of like fat, almost. I'm, just, I'm not fat. Oh no, I'm not gonna fat shame any of you. La 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 la. Stop! In the name of the Empire! Hi, Stark. Hi, Bruce. Who's this guy? So, the meeting begins. I started this meeting. The Empire is taking over the city. We have to do something. We have news from the town. The stormtroopers are coming. Great! Reinforcements! You made it! Take that.
that. Ah! Take that! Stop! In the name of the Empire! Who's this guy? Batman. Ah! Take that! What are we gonna do? There are too many. The coolest thing about traveling the world, knowing different people, is that you see different types of expression and how people have creative ideas. So if you have a problem, like a very hard math problem with algebra letters, don't ask me for help because I can't do my apps, but I'm sure Mr. Doy is a kind man and will help you all too. I don't know how Korea is, but I have watched some Korean movies. And this is my classroom in Costa Rica. They didn't really talk to me or my brother very much, but it was all right because I would just go and play video games or read comics or play Dungeons and Dragons, which is fun. So yeah, I I think I'm a chaotic, good type person because I'm very messy, but I have some creative ideas. So let, let your parents know that you're very smart and you want to read comics and they'll think you're all our superheroes. So yeah. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you all learned a bit more about my life and these cultures. It's very fun to teach lessons and who knows, some days we might meet out there in this beautiful large world. So yeah, thank you Mr. Odoi for being, Kenneth Odoi for being a kind man. To make these stop motions, all you need is a cell phone and some Lego minifigures and you can create little stories with your classmates. Make them talk, make them poop, you know. Thank you Mr. Kenneth Odoi for all of this. I really enjoyed making this video.